Hello everybody and welcome to the first video of the I'll Dream Life channel in which I thought I'm going to show you some parts of my older Animal Crossing New Leaf on my 3DS Nintendo XL size game while I'm in this period waiting for my pre-ordered Nintendo Switch Lite in the Coral Car to arrive because I'm still waiting on that one but I decided why forget about my old town? I've already forgotten about it for months and I recently remembered that it will be cool to kind of get back and see what my town's been up to. So I've been playing it for about a week or two now and I decided it would be a great first video if I started by showing you what my house looked like and how my character is looking right now and all the progress that I've made. Even so, I have way more game time left on this game as well, just so that I can see all the new things that I haven't gotten to yet. So, let's get started. Alright, so as you can see, it is Saturday and there's a special weeding day. But uh, we'll proceed with that later. What I wanted to do first is show you what my character looks like and what my house looks like. So let's go inside and I'm gonna show you through all the rooms that I've built and expanded. Of course, I still have loans to pay off to Nook, but that is to be expected. So when you walk in, you're able to see my main living space Space, like my living room, my kitchen, dining room, every all of that. I'll spin around a little bit. Actually, one of my favorite part is at the front door. So this is a soda case. I believe that's what it was called. And I do imagine then one day when I do feel successful enough, I can have a separate fridge just for drinks, nothing else. Something else that I managed to get is the garbage can, which does make it free to throw your garbage. You don't have to go to the Reese's and pay for some stuff to be thrown out. I've got some fish over here in the tank. Uh, needless to say, I was so surprised when I realized that fish that you actually catch, you're able to put them in aquariums and just admire them inside of your house, like indoors. Some seating area, this pizza box that opens up, which is really cool. And overall kitchen view, some working appliances. Dishwasher, which is really important. It has this short cycle. And then you get to see it ready. Yay! A cute little freezer, which is more appropriate for a camper van, but I do love it. And some other kitchen stuff. A cute little toaster, rice cooker, all that cool stuff. So this is the biggest room. I made sure to improve it before I continue to all the others. Now let's go. Yeah, my TV is working. So this is supposedly my actual, like living room for relaxation, I have the stereo and a piano and it's actually really cool that when villagers are visiting you and you're showing them around you start playing the piano and they start clapping at you which is really cute and supportive I think yeah okay I really wanted this to be like a cool designer space let's see watch TV, have another chair there, yeah, so quite a small, compact and minimalistic room, but I am a fan. So another part that I'm quite proud of is my bathroom. I think it turned out so beautifully, especially with this lamp up here. It looks like an octopus. I have an actual washing machine, which I managed to recently get wrapped with towels, 
bathtub which is separate from this shower but I arranged in such a way that it could be going into the shower a sink but you can also turn the water on and <laughs> yeah this is this was actually some um, limited piece I think I believe it came with one of my uh, splatoon amiibos this shell over here and you can sit on the toilet, which is pretty awesome. And it flushes. Yeah, so I think the bathroom turned out pretty well. All right, let's continue on the first floor. So I created an indoor garden since this is Animal Crossing New Leaf and you can't really have a lot of stuff going on outside that are just yours apart from the public projects and I really wanted something like my own little garden so I made sure that I create something like this invested in the wallpaper and the flooring I have a pool but it would be really cool if your character could interact a little bit more with the pool but she can interact with the bike I think that you can hear sounds from the barbecue baking stuff you can sit on this gorgeous balcony-like table. Yeah. You have bird fountain, some flowers, some birdhouse, a radio. It's just like a really cute, peaceful little place. And yeah, let's keep going to the second floor. All right. So as you can see, I have a basement as well but let's go to the second floor first and there it is this is kind of like bedroom slash office slash a little zoo because um i have a hamster cage i have a goldfish and i have a little froggy which is just doing its froggy sounds this item is pretty cute it's like a foldable little paper diorama thing. I have some books, a lamp. I was really fascinated the first time I got a double bed because I figured you can just roll around on it. Like, how cool is that? And... Of course some clothing items on the wall for whenever I need them and my computer which you can turn off turn on so on so yeah that's it for my room oh yeah an old ass TV it's kind of even looking black and white yes that is all from the bedroom so Let's go and see the last room on this property. And it is the basement going downstairs. So for this room, I'm trying to have the opportunity to expand it a little bit more because as I said, I'm still paying off some loans to knock. My idea for this one is to have like a little relax meditation room, like a Japanese onsen almost with this little hot spring, with some sushi, a cocoa tree, I believe, and this was a musical box that actually I created by getting a song from KK Slider and a giant clamshell. That's how it looks. Little lamp again. Yes. You can just sit, relax to all the sounds and I know that if I had the opportunity to have that many rooms, I would definitely want a room that it's not so functional, but it's just for relaxation purposes. So that is it guys. This was the walk through my character's house in Animal Crossing New Leaf. I hope this was enjoyable and kind of nostalgic for you. I'm planning to make other videos related to Animal Crossing especially. I cannot wait to start with New Horizons. I know that everybody else is way ahead of me, but I decided I want a limited edition 
And when you live in Europe, you gotta wait for the limited edition. So that's that. I'll return to you soon with more videos. If you do like it, if you want to feel relaxed by watching Animal Crossing content and the sweet, sweet life of your isolated town or island, feel free to follow me and see what's coming next. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful and relaxing day. Bye-bye.